Hello everybody and welcome to my guide here on how to install the 2-reel traffic mod for Daikoku properly, quickly, and also make sure that it's quickly working in-game. The first thing we need to do is go to Soyo Daikoku here on this Patreon link. It's free, it will be in the description of the video, and you need to download this track. The next thing that we need to do is we need to go to this GitHub link, which is in the description, and download this right here, which is the missing data for the traffic tool. Without reading all of the extra stuff, that's as simple as it is. So what we'll do is we will browse our local files, and we will hit extension, LUA, tools, CSP traffic tool, and simply replace the data folder with the data folder. And what this is going to do is actually give you the possibility of being able to use the traffic planner tool. So now what we need to do is we need to come up here and download the actual mod part itself, which is going to have two folders, traffic and surfaces, which go into the track folder for Daikoku. So let's show you how to get there again. We will browse local files for Assetto Corsa and we're going to hit content, we're going to hit tracks, and we're going to go to Soyo Daikoku. And at this point, I believe it is under PA data. And we are going to simply take the traffic and drop it in here and replace. I actually can't remember which one I did first, so I'm just going to double do them there and make sure that's working. So now everything is officially ready to go. So let's open up Content Manager and let's go to a single player match. And let's go to Daikoku again. And what you'll notice here is you have these two maps. It doesn't matter which one you use and we will load in. While we're loading in, I will explain that if you do play these maps online, the surfaces.ini and traffic will affect the ability to join online sessions. You will not be able to join online sessions that have checksums enabled with all of this stuff. So if you do want to do that, I highly recommend that you have a second folder for the map that you just change the name of when you want to play offline and offline. So the last thing we need to do is open up Objects Inspector and hit Tools and hit the Traffic Planner. Now I've hit the Traffic Planner and you will see that there are cars here and it does work that easily. There's not much else you really have to do. But if you wish, you can turn up the speed of the traffic, you can turn down the speed of the traffic, you can increase how many traffic cars are nearby, and sometimes it will crash and all you need to do is hit restart, and it's usually really good. If you want to take a look at all of the other stuff here, there is a ton of other things that you can look at to see how the layout has been done. Now I'm not going to drive around the map today, all I wanted to do was show you guys how to install this, and it really is that easy. And what you'll notice as well is it says I've got 1500 traffic cars here, and we are not hitting any lag stutter at all. So I don't know exactly how these vehicles are rendered in to this, whether they're just like objects or whatever it might be but it, you don't have the struggle of online traffic gameplay while you are running something like this. My frames are consistent, they are not going to budge, and that is the main goal of this video today, is just to show you guys that yes, there is now a 100% free offline traffic mod, which is super easy to use, and is available on a few maps and is optimized, runs well, and you don't have to worry about playing this mod with traffic by yourself offline. 
So that's it, everybody. I just wanted to go over that because the c install guide was a little confusing, and I thought this would be a good way to make some more content and provide more positive information for all of our low-spec PC members in the community that we have out here today, and try and make this game, yet again, more accessible to everybody and not just the big servers out there that run really crazy specs and people have issues. So here's the traffic mod, that's how it works. It is that easy. If you need help, give me a shout, I will help you out. And enjoy your day everybody. If you're one of those people that can't play with us online in our servers, I hope that you can now play offline in traffic and stay gaming on a Assetto and enjoy your day. Thank you everybody, take care.